I got Willie. I don't know how I got Willie. I got Willie in that first game. <laughs> Hi, Dragonfly. Malcolm, what's up? Malcolm? You're welcome. <laughs> it is getting ridiculous, but it's fun. Welcome to game three. Here we go. River Rats versus Two Baggers. Right hand side. Brick will be starting out. Against Jacob. Or Jake. Rick's got his first one on. Nice. Rick's been shooting good. And. Lexi's not paying attention. Oh my god. Brutal. That's not fair. <clears throat> well, that's, that's Rick's fault for not hooking him. Okay. So after that happens, this is Lexi for the River Rats. Against Mike back there from Two Beggars. Everybody seems to be in black shirts today. We're the only ones wearing a crown. So Lexi got two points, pretty close. So he needs almost a ringer to beat it. Nope. I have that scoreboard in the left screen. You can barely see what it says. So I like the bigger the bigger scoreboard. That might be on or a little short. Lexi's uh, indicating one point. Was it? I think we're calling that even. I think. <clears throat> oh, nice shoe. Good forty feet. like Lexi's going to disappear into the screen jumping back and forth seems to go wherever if she hits she'll stay oh, I think she'll stay there now it's a good cover with a 
a really sloppy point. Can't believe she's actually going to take that point. <laughs> he's putting them on, but he's turning them backwards. And that was basically a six pack. On the other pit, I'm like, trying to get Willie to score it right. Nobody's really Rick's Rickstone pretty good. He's throwing them on. He's just they're not hooking. Be nice if they hooked, but you can't control that really. It's just where you throw them, I guess. There we go. That seems to be a good good shoe. It's backwards, but if it gets knocked, it'll hopefully hook. We'll take three. So far running a skunk arm. I'm sure that will not stay a skunk. <clears throat> Lexi's struggling a little bit this game. to get some points there. There it is. No skunky. <laughs> oh, didn't hear any wood. Like, like, like Mike said, it was clean. So usually I don't, I don't generally throw short. If I throw a 39 foot shoe, it's probably once or twice a night, maybe. Everything else is 40 or 41. So I don't get that kind of chance. If I miss to the left or the right, it's not going on. And usually if I if I come short, it's usually on because of the slide. So they get three. Wide open, what you throw is what you keep. Come on, Lex, pick that. 
Yeah, six pick. That would be a good time. Make it 19 to 10. You would think if she's not doing too well on that uh, left side of the pitch, she should move over in front of the camera. Come on, we got to put, get into the, uh, the promised land there, 15 or higher. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. good shoe, just not uh, fully rotated. There we go. That's a good reset. It's good Rick's throwing in uh, pretty good because uh, definitely need him. When we get to uh, the 13th, 13th through 18th week, we'll definitely need everybody at uh, firing on all all eight cylinders here. So we'll just get three on that one. All right, time to move over, relax. Try, try this other side here. There he goes. All right, Rick, time to finish it. If he leaves this open, Rick's got to end it. <clears throat> that was a good shoe, just wasn't open. We'll see if Rick gets his first one on, and uh, I'd basically say it's it's a done game. Oh, so I think Lexi will get to be able to shoot again again now, even if he gets a ringer. No. Nope. That's one for two baggers. So you just got one sitting in there. All right, Lexi moves over. Try something different. It's got the uh, good idea. It's off balance, completely off balance on there. Better balance there. There you go. Yeah, you can definitely see how uh, she's off balance. Sometimes she does that in bags too. She'll throw like that and she'll start leaning, having fun, and start leaning and leaning, and that leaning doesn't do anything for you. Just throws you off. Might have been a timing thing, could have been slippage. Probably timing. There's Rick. <clears throat> this is coming in perfect, Dave. 
There it is. Might have backed off a little bit. It's a lot of pressure on Jake staring at what looks like a six pack. I'd call that a six pack. Way to finish it. Great job. Well, thanks for watching. And we'll see you in the next in uh, game four, match four. Thanks for watching, Dragonfly and Malcolm. Anybody else out there? I'll definitely talk to you. We'll see you later. Bye.